This is Nike's Vipost Touch, and this is Wi-Fi MDB RS232 MDB converter box. And we now we test the Vipost Touch with the MDB box. And uh, we first we connect the MDB connector, plug it to the Vipost Touch, and then power on with DC24. Okay, and uh, to power on the MDB box, and the MDB box will supply the power supply to the Vipos Touch power on. Okay, power on. Because the Nike's Vipos Touch first need to connect to the server, so we need to connect to the net and the install the SIM card correctly, and. Uh, we we'll need some minutes to reset and power on and connect and register it to the server. Okay, and then need to wait some minutes. After connected, the we post touch will display the QR code or the uh, picture. Then we can scan the card. Okay, initialize the modem. And then we can send the command from the PC, the RS232 command, to read the config data and also control the, enable the card reader and then accept the payment credit. So this PC will work, work as the VMC board. Of course, users will, can use the Raspberry Pi or the Android board. RS232 is the RDB2 connector and we use the USB to RS232 adapter wire. Of course, if your computer have the RS232 connector, then we can connect it directly. We still need to wait. We can send the command to read the configuration and also send the price to the card reader and then use the card to pay every time power on we need some minutes because the card reader need to register to the server and when it gets approved, then the card reader will start to work. And then we can send the MDB command to enable it. So if you want to test the Nyx card reader, you must confirm with Nyx company. This reader is already approved in the server. If you buy a reset, the Come on, CMD. When the device is approved, then the MDB data will be start. Okay, start. We received the reset. Okay. And wait the card reader. Reset, okay. That means MDB already started. We can send the command to read the config data. Okay. Send the command. 
reply. Set up the maximum price. Read the ID. Enable. Enable. Okay. And then we start to send the price. Select the a good. Send the good selected command to the card reader. Okay, we selected the goods and the price is five. Authorizing. Okay, approved. Thank you. End the section. Send the end the section. Okay. This is already finished. Just now, that command list is always idle mode because the VMC can send the price list directly. And we also can swipe the card first. Okay, now select the goods. This is a test card. Please select the product. Received the card swiped command. And then we send the goods selected information. Authorizing. Approved. Thank you. And the section. Charged. And then enable. Okay, thank you.